Good morning, you guys. It's me, Kiana, and as you can see, I'm coming to you naked, totally, face naked, hair naked, and everything. I'm doing that because I wanted to do a review for you guys for a particular company, and I wanted to actually um, come to you with a makeup tutorial following this wig, wig review um, so that you guys can actually know how to apply the entire look that you see um, every day before you. Uh, when I do videos and I'm only doing this because so many have actually asked for me to start doing makeup tutorials like I used to and um, I thought it was perfect timing being that this look will be great for holidays um, it'll be great for holiday parties um, just holiday events and things like that so it's just in time for Christmas Christmas Eve New Year's Eve and things like that so um, yeah I'm coming to you guys and uh, we're going to start our wig review First of all, it is with a company by the name of Hair and Wig Couture, um, and I agreed to work with this company. Um, I'll be. This is one of the things that's starting for this year. Um, it is a few companies that I actually will be affiliated with and working for, um, and I wanted to do this review um, on this hair because I just thought it was really, really, really pretty. Um, the color is perfect for me. Let me show you guys. Of course, it came in your standard packaging. It was shipped very well. This is the hair, and her name is Braid Lace Front Yolanda. And it's by it's a, a wig collection. And this color is DX2216. What I'll do is I'll make sure I put all of the stuff I just gave you, all the information. I will make sure I put that in the description box below. But it is Braid Lace Yolanda Braid Lace Front Wig. This is how it looks when it comes in the packaging. This is the first time I'm taking it out, you guys. I'm taking it out in front of you guys. This is the wig. This is the hairline on the wig. Ear to ear lace. It has two combs in the front, you guys. Your standard one comb in the back. And it also has your adjustable straps, as you can see on the side. So it looks pretty secure. This is a wig that you don't have to, um, you don't have to actually uh, tape it down. Um, I'm just showing you guys how I do it. You may do it differently, but this is how I do my lace fronts. Okay, so I just simply go along the hairline. I start with the ear. You guys see? I just take your regular standard scissors, nothing special, and just go like maybe a quarter of a centimeter away from the hairline that's on here. You want to go from ear to ear. Removing the lace, of course. And this is how it looks once the lace is removed. Now, you can always go closer, but this is just the amount that I'm taking off right now. I may have to go a little closer. I see that in some spots I can do so <clears throat> so I'm just going to take two more little pieces off <clears throat> then you're just going to simply put it on
The hairline is really, really good, you guys, because it's not that, um, you know how the hairline is like too square or too oval? Yeah, the oval. Uh, yeah, it's not like that. It's snug. So for you guys out there that don't have a, if you have a kind of big head. <laughs> Now, as you can see, the hairline. is great. It's laying really flat, you guys. This is a no-brainer. You do not have to try to rig this to make it have a better hairline or you don't have to rig this to make it look better. I think it's cute. I do think it's unique with the braid right here. And in fact, because I like big hair, I would even pump it up a little bit more with a little bit of hairspray, you guys, which I'm going to do in a second. I don't even have the tab secure, you guys. I don't have the tab secure. And it's snug. It came with a little braid. It really is snug, you guys. Like, I don't have the tabs. I don't have the clips. I don't have any of that secure. And it's tight on my head. Not tight to the point that it's like... It's not tight to the point where it's like hurting my head. Meaning that, like, it's not going anywhere, as you can see. Now, if you want, you can always use um, a few pins for right here. All you have to do is just put a pin right here. And then turn the pin inward and then outward, and that will secure that area right here. So that when you know when you pull on it doesn't flap or nothing right here. Or you could just simply take, um, you know, if you don't want to use the glue, you can take one of these strips and just put one right there on the sides. You will not need it anywhere up here. You will not need it from here. None of this, none of this area right here. Now you may want to put, like I said, the pins right here. Or you could put glue right here, or you could put the strips, um, you know, the tape. So that's up to you. But I love it. I like it a whole lot, actually. <clears throat> I'm just going to take a little bit of spray. And just pump it up some more. Cause I want this this up here to be pumped up real full and this hair reminds me you guys of the um, Beyonce when she first came out that's what this reminds me of you like it daddy <laughs> daddy uh, it's already suiting his approval obviously so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna use some pins he said, wow. <laughs> I'm going to use some pens, you guys, and just uh, use it for the side. As you can see, the color is absolutely beautiful, you guys. Again, this color is DX2216. I absolutely love it, you guys. I will be rocking this today. And I will be rocking this um, <clears throat> while I'm doing my makeup tutorial. This is the hairline again, you guys. This is the braid. The braid is absolutely gorgeous, you guys. And like I said, this reminds, this hairstyle reminds me exactly like the Beyonce hair when she first came out. And she had her hair just like this, and it was a braid around it. Go figure, it was a lace front. Yeah. But, um, I love it. And it's really, really full, you guys. It's really full. As far as length, I would say it's about 18 inches. 
between 16 and 18 inches so it's not too long but it's just enough length that you can pump it up as much as you want and all you have to do is just let the hair spray you know dry a little bit and then pump it again scrunch it with your fingers let it dry a little bit and that's just going to keep building it as big as you want it as for me this is probably enough for me right now but I love it so alright you guys so again uh, hair and wig couture that's where this came from make sure you go check their site out this I believe is about 40 bucks you guys but it's a nice lace front it's definitely not a lace front that you're gonna see a lot of people have you know how we get you know we get hair that sometimes we it's repetitive at some, at some point this is not gonna be like that because I haven't really seen too many of the braided lace fronts um, and they have a lot of different ones it's like this with the braids they have some with braids and it's straight um, some with braids and it's curly and spiral hair so make sure you go check them out you guys this is called Yolanda um, she is about 40 bucks at hair wig couture be looking out for uh, many more uh, reviews for them because like I said I will be working with them and um, I look so forward to it um, they're really really nice company customer service is really good you guys literally they mail this out um, Friday and I got it Monday so that tells you right there about the shipping alright so the next video is going to be I like it a lot the next video is going to be um, yeah my makeup tutorial and once the makeup and everything is done you guys you're going to see the whole look pulled together uh, with the new hair the makeup and you're going to actually see um, not only the transformation but you're going to see how a good lace front or a really stylish lace front can actually take your look to another level so alright you guys I love you all so much if you like thumbs up and make sure you comment alright you guys love you be blessed